Welcome. Today I'm joined in studio with Tsebo Outsourcing Group CEO Clive Smith, who will be discussing the reasons for his company's participation in the 2014 Investing in African Mining in Dalba and what his company has to offer the mining industry. Clive, thank you for joining us. Tell us a bit about why you guys have decided to participate in the mining in Darba and uh, what you're looking t- looking for to get out of it and, and in terms of the growth of the company going forward. Okay. Good afternoon. Um, Seba Outsourcing Group has been around around 40 years. It's primarily known by some of its market-facing brands, Drake & Skull, FedEx, um, the catering brand. But the group itself, Outsourcing Group, is a consolidation of, of a multitude of brands. Over the last couple of years, we've been adding those brands, adding products and services, adding geographies to to our delivery capacity. We've got a a strategy to get heavily into Africa. We've diversified from being 90%, 95% South African a couple of years ago to now being almost 70% South African as far as our turnover and our staff numbers are concerned. So we really are to have a deep penetration into Africa. With that, we've added on products, sort of energy solutions, where we've got deep diagnostic and, and real diagnostic tools we can use for our clients. We've got facility tools, we've got camp management tools, and we think that, that those would be of interest to and kind of assistance to, especially in these tough economic climates, to, to enable cost savings, to be able to deploy more value back into maybe labor, investment in the communities as opposed to into energy, etc., for our mining customers. And with that, we felt that this year's mining in Darba we would like to be have more exposure. We've always been at the Indaba, but this time a bit more exposure. We're lifting up from the micro brands to the macro brand of the company to expose it to the African players. We expect that over the next couple of years, I um, mean, we are busy with a couple of transactions right now. Where we could, we're going to add more brands and services to our businesses, particularly in African countries. That would see us get to around 60% South African, 40% African, and will take us up from our current sort of nine, 10 African countries up to 15 to 20 African countries in 12 months. At that point, we'll have feet on the ground, penetration in most of those customers and those mining companies, um, sites, premises, or, or geographies. And that means that from a group perspective, those customers become important to us. Um, not that they aren't already, but they become more important to us. And we think that we can interact now at a more senior level, at a more strategic level, and interact to a system strategically. Thank you, Clive. That was Sebo Outsourcing Group CEO, Clive Smith, sharing his thoughts on the importance of the mining in Dalba to his company and what Sebo has to offer the industry.